I'm going to show you the emergency alert system in action. And remember, what you're about to see is only a test. It's 3.15 a.m. and I'm rolling into the station because this month's required monthly test comes at 3.45. I'm gonna need some coffee. EAS is set up in a hierarchical model. Everyone monitors their local primary stations, who monitor the state primary stations, who monitor the primary entry point stations, which are fed directly by the United States federal government. This morning, we're receiving our required monthly test from the State Emergency Management Agency. When the SAGE EAS decoders receive it, we have an hour to forward it before it's done automatically. When the EAS message is received, it will show up on our studio status screens. This is triggered by a GPO pin on the SAGE EAS decoder. At that point, the board operator will need to log into the device and look at the nature of the pending EAS message. If it's something that must be forwarded, the board operator will put the automation system in live assist mode and insert a pause command, usually at the end of a commercial break. If it's a national emergency or national periodic test, we don't have this luxury. When the pause comes, we just click the send button on the web interface. The index will take over the air feed and the control room monitors will switch to an air chain feed positioned between EAS and the terrestrial stream split. statewide test of the Ohio Emergency Alert System, originating from the State Emergency Operations Center in Columbus. This is only a test. The Ohio Emergency Alert System has been designed to provide the public with timely warnings and emergency information. Had this been an actual emergency, you would have received instructions and information related to that emergency over this and other stations in your area. This concludes this test of the Ohio Emergency Alert System. Then we simply fade and go on the automation system. Mix 94.9 plays your favorite artists from A to Z. If you look on my YouTube channel, you can find an overview of this year's national periodic test of the EAS. Personally, I think it's pretty cool. I'll be back next weekend with a new video. As always, follow for more.